guys, welcome back to the Drown Machine tutorial. Today, as we let, as you know, we left off with this dispenser facing down roof. And today, we're going to be placing the, the water buckets all in the dispensers. It's a bit of some boring stuff, so I'm going to go ahead and cut ahead in the video to work to when I placed down all these water buckets. So, bye for now. Guys, as you can see, we've like placed all these buckets down. So now it's time to get to the redstone part. So we're just gonna get some bedrock here. We're just gonna do a quick little staircase down to the floor. And then, do some redstone which is in this it's going to be pretty easy to do which I start guys we're back and as you see I've done like a very quick staircase here so now let's test it out why shouldn't we so let's go get why don't we test out on a Test out on a blaze. So all we need to do just go round here. Is this our run out? And now we just well we we're supposed to be doing this in survival, but we can just fly up. So now we just click this lever. As you see, all of the spaces are going on, and be, I'll be quiet for a second so you can listen to Blaze getting hurt in there. And as you see, he just died from drowning. So now we just turn off this, turn this off. Oh no! I didn't make this up. There. So we just flick the lever again and it should pick all the water back up, hopefully. Wait, it should be that. That should have done it. So yep, as you can see, the water's just getting lower and lower and lower. And now at this point, you just have to walk in, get the drops. But it doesn't look look like the blaze dropped anything. So let's test out on some other mobs. We'll test it out on a... Test it out on a hmm, a pig, a sheep, zombie pigman, and a cow. Why not? Pig, sheep, zombie pigman, cow. So now we just do a little flick flick. So now it should be on and soon you shall hear them getting hurt so I'll be quiet for a second so you can hear them get hurt so, so as you hear they're getting they're drowning and getting hurt so now you can just go ahead and flick the switch again two times and now you should be able to go in and collect all the drops when you wait for the water to go down guys I'm back so the water has now just got floated down so now we can just walk in and collect the drops and as you see there's all the drops and a random bucket down there so now 
we got like the le the lever from the cow, the wool from the sheep, and yeah. So that's how you make a drowning machine in Minecraft. So and that this is the, sadly the end of the episode and the tutorial. So I appreciate it if you click that thumbs up button or um or subscribe and I'll, I'll see you, I'll see you in the next series so bye